Welcome back guys to my YouTube channel Kelvin Babylonia Triskelion I'm back for another reaction video and This time it's gonna be on the Hashtag Manila Bay Challenge So This is a Video regarding the Manila Bay Challenge wherein the A lot of people uh, Post a meme On the said The uh, Manila Bay area where in the uh, the government of the Philippines uh, created a man-made sand at the Manila Bay uh, for the pur sole purpose of its uh, beautification and to promote terror uh, and to promote tourism so I have researched about it and uh, uh, I have learned that uh, the government spent around 389 million pesos more or less uh, that is the amount spent by the government uh, and, and uh, I have also researched that uh, they use uh, dolomite sand coming from the part of the Visayas, the Cebu so and uh, the, the Dolomite San was uh, uh, accordingly it was used for the it was uh, used for the it is used for the construction uh, materials so and uh, according to other groups uh, it is uh, harmful to to human when it uh, it is uh, inhaled so uh, half of the people are very worried about this uh, movement by the government uh, on the on that uh, part of the island of the on that part of the uh, area the the Manila Bay so you know guys I want to share about uh, about the part of the Philippines uh, where I visited uh, in Bohol there is a man-made forest there so when we went there it was very beautiful uh, the, the trees are growing uh, very straight so it's very obvious that it's a man-made forest because the trees are, are growing very straight and, and like in the jungle the, the trees are, are free when it is uh, growing so I, I came to think that uh, uh, the Manila Bay would be a, a great uh, areas someday when it uh, when it will open back uh, on September 19 and 20 uh, it was open for the public for the first time after it was a uh, dump or uh, beauty beautify with the dolomite sun so the problem is uh, at this uh, pandemic people did not observe uh, social distancing that's why the viral uh, photo taken by a newspaper organization uh, went viral because uh, at this time people should observe the health protocols but uh, uh, they, the people, the Filipino people are hard-headed uh, they want to see the, the area but uh, they did not observe the protocol, the health protocols, especially the social distancing, and one meter apart uh, between the other persons. So that is a big, very big uh, risk uh, for a chance to get uh, coronavirus uh, for the spread of the virus. And because of the viral video, the Filipino created a, a meme. It's a very funny meme. You know, Filipinos are very, 
very happy uh, they always find ways to smile and make a uh, and make a meme about uh, a photo so that is a very good trait for the Filipino that's why uh, it went viral some people post that uh, they are only there relaxing that's why people people are uh, on the footbridge are are watching him or him or her so anyway guys the government is uh, is doing their best so we must uh, help our government uh, in these times of pandemic even though they spent roughly 389 million pesos during this pandemic but uh, that is also the job of the uh, DENR the Department of Environment and Natural Resources so we should respect their actions regarding the, the Manila Bay uh, beautification by uh, dumping the Dolomite sand but uh, the sad part is uh, there is a corrosion uh, from the sea because uh, the dolomite is uh, uh, following uh, or going to the flow of, uh, of, the, of the sea dolomites are being uh, carried away by the water so uh, because of this uh, maybe we should uh, uh, focus later maybe there are other actions uh, that's why uh, DNR is not yet finished uh, beautifying the Manila Bay so hopefully we will uh, see changes uh, this uh, this uh, improvements of the Manila Bay so we will see we will see how may, uh, if it if it will open back again to the public and uh, hopefully uh, the law enforcers will uh, enforce the social distancing measures to prevent the coronavirus That's it guys, thank you for watching, hope you like this reaction video and uh, may you have a good day, thank you and uh, take care.